hello guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to chimino chimino's kitchen today's video i'll be showing you guys how to prepare a uh, my cauliflower my cauliflower continentals so stay tuned and watch the video till the end to get the whole info and this on how i prepare this uh, delicious cauliflower I'll be using so many things to prepare it. This is the cauliflower. All I need to do is just to dice it into smaller pieces. I'll just dice it into smaller pieces. Yes. So stay tuned to watch the video so you get every info. Yes. So what first thing I need to do is just to take water and wash my cauliflower. I'll just wash it so that it will be clean. So I'll just dice it into smaller, smaller pieces like this, just to cut it small, small like this. Yes, this is just how I want to cut it. Come, sister or baby, I'll just cut it into into smaller pieces yes so because i'm going to blend it so i just need to cut it so small small pieces like this i'll just chop it up like, like this i'm <laughs> sorry for the noise in the background my little boy is helping mommy to cook This is it. This is how it looks like, guys. Eh? Yeah. I'll chop it into smaller, smaller pieces so that small pieces so that I can enter my blend. I can blend. Look at it. So the next page is just to blend it to get the desired size I want. Just like as if you want to prepare a fried rice, <laughs> but just like this. See it, guys. See, I just chop it into smaller, smaller pieces like this. So, just to blend. So as I finish, look at it. So, I all I need to do is just to blend it. I'll just blend the coral flower. So I just put some, just little quantity because I will not be adding water. So I'll just put little quantity so that it can, it can blend. So it won't spoil my blender. So I'll just be putting it small, small to blend all. So. Look at it, juice. No water, just only the color flower. So I use. <laughs> Cassie, you're helping me, right? So that is like this. So look at it. Just blend, look at it. So I'll just remove this one. That's how it looks like. I'll just remove this one, just blend it gradually till I finish everything. So I'll just be blending it. If I add much because I don't add water, so it might spoil my blender. So I'll just be adding little, little by little, so till I finish blending all. Yeah. 
Ja. So guys, it's ready. I'll finish. I just want to prepare it now. So look at the thing. This is the correct color. Just look at the cauliflower. Look at how smooth it looks. After blending it, it looks like this. So I'll be using this president butter to prepare it. And this oil, olive oil, this salt, smaggy cube. I'll be using a gizzard for that. And this is spring onions and pepper. So let's get started. So the first thing I need to do is just to add my oil. I just need to add little of this oil inside the pan. Not much because I'll be adding butter. So I don't want it to be much. So I add butter also. So I just cut a little bit of this precedent butter. I like the test of it in my food and it's low in fat, so I use it mostly on my cooking. So I add a little bit of this and also the next thing I add is this. So I add my dessert. So I'll add this uh, spring onion inside. Then I'll add a little bit of salt. I'll just add my salt inside. Just a little bit of salt for taste. I'll add salt for test, so is it? Then I will just add a cube of Maggi. Just one cube is enough for me. Okay. I just add a cube into it and and I'll stay. I add a bit of pepper inside, so yeah. I'll add the blender for pepper, so I'll just add. Come to stop! He almost look for sure to climb so that he can see everything. Bro, I'm making video.
this how it looks like guys so I'll continue to stay it until it's done Carrot, diced corn, diced carrots, green pepper. Yeah, I just need to add it inside also. And I'll just take it. This is how it looks like. Very juicy. If you are the type you don't like um, maybe testing new food or you don't like colorful, you can prepare it like this. You will, you will love it, and kids also can will love it because it's be, be just easy to digest and easy for them to eat also. at it here so yummy delicious yep so guys so guys i have to end the video here guys but please before i end this video if you have not subscribed to my youtube channel guys i am begging you eh subscribe to my youtube channel just click that red subscription button and just subscribe it's free of charge it costs you nothing to subscribe to my youtube channel please guys some of you will just watch my video and you just go it's not good now try to encourage me by just click that subscription red subscription button down below it's just free of charge it doesn't cost you anything and please guys try and also like my video anytime you watch my video try to like the video or comment or even share the video with your family and friends please just to encourage me i'm begging you guys and thank you so 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 much for tuning in to my channel and i upload videos every sunday so every sunday just go to my channel you see a new video to watch and thank you guys so so much for standing by to watch my video to the end i really thank you guys so much just try this new recipe on my recipe on how to cook curry flour continental it's just easy to prepare it's just easy to prepare no stress just very easy and try to change diets and new things it doesn't take anything so guys i thank you very very much for watching my video till the end god bless you guys see you guys in my next video bye